Hey, what's going on guys? We will YouTube here, back with another video. And this is yet another new series of mine. I see me having a lot of these lately. But it is known as Broken Plays. It is basically where I go through the OTKs of various decks within the meta at the moment. And the first deck we're going to have is Insectors. Uh, my friend John Ash was kind enough to uh, offer his Insector deck to show us the various OTKs that the deck has. So we're going to get into them right now. As you can see on the screen, they do involve three cards. Okay guys, and we are back. I'm going to hand it over to John straight away for his discussion of the OTKs. Over to you, John. Alright, time for some Insector shenanigans. So, you need this in the hand, this in the hand, and then trust your old Hornet in the hand or the graveyard, it doesn't really matter. Summon the Dragonfly, as usual, give it that, give it that, pop this, that triggers two special summons. You want to bring out your two Insector Centipedes, then you want to pop another one, using one of them's effect, to search out Gigamanus, then you want to overlay the one that used its effect and the Dragonfly for the Leviathan Dragon. This will allow you to detach your Dragonfly, which is important. Then, with the one that hasn't used its effect, Gigamantis to Gigamantis effect, equip it to the Centipede. Use Centipede's effect to give it the Hornet. Pop it. Pop the uh, pop the Gigamantis. Triggers the special summoning of the Dragonfly, and then you want to add two cards to your hand with using his effect. You can pick a Ladybug and another another Zek Caliber. Then you want to. Then you have a couple of choices. Then you can go Ladybug, make him a rank 5, bring out a Centipede, Ladybug, again, make a rank 5, and you can go Exostag, you can take a mud opponent's monster, something you want to keep, like a Graffa, overlay for the for Gaia Dragon, or if you want to keep it a rank 3, something like a, something like a Acid Golem, a Giga Brilliant, and then the one that hasn't used its effect, just simply beef them up a bit with Gigamantis and Zek Caliber for over 8,000. What's the t what's the total damage there? It's 2,500 plus 3,200 plus 3,000. So it's 60, 62 plus 25, which is like 87, yeah. 8,700 damage. It's enough to get the job done. So that's definitely an OTK. Okay, we're going to go through a second OTK, which is obviously much more consistent involving Call of the Haunted. So more on that next. Okay guys, and we are back. This is the second OTK, or the second part of the OTK. John has left it so that the Leviathan Dragon has already detached the Dragonfly. The Centipede has already equipped the Hornet and the Gigamantis and sent both of them to bring that Dragonfly you see in the middle of the field back. And the face down card is his Call of the Haunted. So over to you, John. And add these two cards to your hand. So these are in your hand. Okay, so you go Ladybug, give the Dragonfly, send, bring out a Centipede. Ladybug to Centipede, send. Increase both to five. By the way, you can add another 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 Zach Caliber. It doesn't really matter. Overlay for a rank five. Uh, you can do Adrius. You can do Exostag. You can't do Adrius if there's nothing to send. You need you need to, you need to detach because we're using Call of it. So let's say Exostag. Detach your Dragonfly. Then you got your Call of Hunted. Bring him back. Give the Dragonfly the Ladybug. Increase to four. To splash summon a ladybug, give this ladybug to that ladybug, increase to four, overlay these for a utopia, give your Zach Caliber to your centipede, and you've got quite a beefy field. Oh, wait, we can make this slightly beefier. There we go. <laughs> oh, that's the stuff um, right there. And that is even more. And all you, the only difference is the Call of Haunted. This, obviously, this could be a monster you want as well. But on the off chance that your opponent somehow is like 10,000 life points, which is incidentally is the exact amount of damage that this OTK does, uh, yeah. you know, you can take all those life points away from them as well. Yeah. So yeah, short and sweet, but very, very awesome. Boom! Yeah, boom, baby. Boom! <laughs> Thanks for that, John. Uh, You're welcome. Yeah, that's it for the video, guys. Uh, thank you so much for watching, as always. Be sure to comment, rate, and subscribe. I have plenty more OTKs coming up soon. I think wind-ups have been pretty exhausted at this point, so I might go through the one that I use in Mermails. Again, it only requires three cards, so stay tuned for that, guys. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe, as I said. Peace out.